This unique man from Norway is called Sondre Berg. Just look at what he does with his own weight. For example, have you ever seen a movement like this? Or this flip from hand to hand? In general, if you rate this level in calisthenics from 1 to 10, to this scale I would also add a level called Sondre Berg. Because these guys' style and skills are like no others. And the first test for Sondre was prepared by my friend Andre, in which he had to do push-ups with as much extra weight as possible. And make sure to pause at the lowest point of the amplitude and we will start with 20 kilos at once right. easy yeah it's a bit uncomfortable it's weird because i'm not used to hand standing with weight so balance is a bit strange but I mean, it didn't feel too heavy. Well, let's move on. Sondre now has 30 kg. Then it was decided to add two more discs on the edges of the west, which made 35 kg in total. Well, this is where the tension is already felt, but Sondre and Andre went even further and added more weights. Sondre made two attempts but could not find a balance. So the west was changed for a fixture, which simply holds two discs in the front and back. The weight is the same, 40 kg. Push. Push! Push! Yes! <laughs> Well, to make sure that this is really the maximum that Sondre is capable of, we added another 3 kg, and as we can see that was the maximum, so we fixed the handstand with the weight of 40 kg. As you can see, Sondre definitely has a lot of power, but even more important in his case, the athlete uses his inertia in a cool way, which allows him to do something like this. We asked Sondre if he practices basic movements such as pull-ups and push-ups. It depends on your definition of basics, I guess. Uh, I do train pull-ups, but I train towards the one-arm pull-up and I do train push-ups, but I'm doing different variations of handstand push-ups. Uh, I think that um, if you want to focus on building strength, it's important to progressively overload your muscles in terms of the difficulty of the exercise. So if you're just doing regular push-ups uh, and building up repetitions to 100 to 200, then uh, you're not going to get very much stronger. Uh, you're just gonna get uh, much more endurance. Based on Sondre's words, we decided not to mock the guy and not to check how many he can bench press or how much he can pull up with extra weight on the bar. By the way, if you carefully analyze his channel, you can find here a version of the bench press which looks much more spectacular than the standard one. And in theory, it is very similar to it in its biomechanics. But whether Sondre can bench press the bar with the same weight, I don't know. Right in a comments if you want to check it out. In the meantime, I would like to pay your attention to the athlete's mobility. And the way one movement flows into another, that's what makes Sondre so unique. And believe me, this is not something that was given to him from birth. He worked hard to improve his mobility. And not so long ago, he even started a challenge, which to be honest, I don't know how to describe in words, so just watch. Of course, a lot of people have tried to repeat it, but I suggest you look at the most beautiful attempt from Canadian girl named Summer. I mosquitoes and I don't like killing them. In general, in the fifth minute, Summer finally nailed Sondra's challenge. And I know that girls are naturally much more flexible than guys. And the victory dance, you just have to check it out. Now let's have a quick look at Sondre's jumping ability. And this time he will be tested by two professional gymnasts from the national team. By the way, their warm-up was not standard. The first test was to catch the head and flip forward. The next step was to knock the head down with a backflip. And that is where Sondre really surprised me. I didn't think he could do it on the first try. So don't write any bad comments under this video or otherwise. I think the reason why Sondre does so well in other disciplines is because he had borrowed many of his movements from other directions. This video resonated on Instagram, so the athlete even recorded a separate video on how he came up with the idea to do this element. By the way, Sondre himself said in our interview that push-ups in a standing position on one hand without the support of any person is the most desirable element for him at this moment. In fact, to this day, no one has ever been able to do this movement with the proper technique. Personal records in everything, uh, that's important to e everyone, I think. Uh, if you don't uh, have uh, your personal records to beat, then you have no goals to sort of uh, move past. So to me, it's important to have a record 
uh, for every exercise that I do. But it's not like I have any world records, at least that I know of. <laughs> but I do have personal records. Uh, not that I can tell you <coughs> like on the top of my, from the top of my head. Uh, I'd have to look through my notebook to see the exact numbers. <laughs> After all, Sondre set his personal record for jumping from 1 meter 65 centimeters, and he also climbed the wall at level 7A, which is a high level of climbing. And it became possible because instead of just pushing up the number of repetitions, the athlete complicates the movement itself, thereby ensuring a steady progress in basic movements. I think like uh, uh, the most important thing uh, to realize is that if you just stick to it, you'll eventually get good. I think a lot of people they give up way too soon. Uh, when at first, when they meet some hardship, they get some stagnation, they get an injury, and then they just like stop because it gets too difficult or it starts. It's not so much fun anymore because the progress is sort of slacking off. Uh, but I think if you just like stick to it uh, for a long enough time, uh, you're gonna you're gonna reach your goals and you're gonna shoot for the stars. Yeah. It's a good point. Yeah. Looking at all these cool moves that Sonre is doing, most people are basically just saying to themselves something like Oh my god! However, there are those who want to achieve same results. For such people, we have a project that is aimed at developing your functionality and the base as a whole. To learn more, just follow the link in the description. Links to Sondre Berg's app and social pages I will leave in the description as well. With you as always was Fyodor Chepki. See ya!